And Bieber oh. is hit by the pitch. Now, did he swing? They say no swing. I don't think he's he hit by the pitch, and the bases are loaded. All right, Buck is incensed. Let's see. I say, oh, oh yeah, he swung. He swung, he swung the bat. Going to get run. And yep. now he has been thrown out. So Buck Showalter is starting to get pissed off lately. He was so calm last year, but this year the Mets are not playing so well, and he's starting to get tossed pretty frequently. So here we have Brewers versus Mets. It's a three to two game, top of the eighth. Two outs, men on first and second, an 0-1 count. And we get a fastball that tails into the batter. He checks swings and gets hit by a pitch. Now the umpire calls it a hit by pitch. He awards first base to the hitter. Buck is not happy. And here's a really good shot at it. So let's back up here and take another look. Now the whole check swing rule, there really isn't a check swing. It's either a swing or it's not a swing. But... The rule states that the ball is swung at by the batter and missed. So you have to figure out, is it a swing or is it not a swing? And again, this is tough because you see the batter here. So he's starting his swing. He's continuing to go. I don't even know how he started his swing in the first place. I mean, this ball is thrown way up and in. But as he continues to turn right there he gets hit by the ball on the hand. Now, if you look at his bat, you can see that the bat is clearly not entered the hitting zone yet. But after he gets hit, as he continues to turn, the bat comes through the hitting zone. The hand stop, but the bat continues to come through the hitting zone. And you can see the bat actually comes all the way around. Now, he doesn't even have two hands on the bat anymore. This hand is probably killing him right now, so he just lets go of the bat. But the bat technically goes all the way around his body. But again, it was after the ball hit him, so would he have not swung if the ball didn't hit him? And we'll never know because the ball did hit him. Now, I personally think that he would have continued his swing and not stopped even if the ball didn't hit him. Again, that's just my opinion. It's tough to tell. And since the ball does hit him before he strikes it, we don't know what he would have done. So it's a really tight and tough call. And I think if they do call this a strike instead of a hit by pitch, I think Brewers manager Craig Council gets pissed off and he might get tossed. So either way, whether it's Showalter or Council, somebody's going to get pissed and probably get thrown out of the game. Now, again, I'm right there with Buck. I'm getting really upset about this because the bat does come all the way around. And I know it's tough to tell because he's getting hit before the bat really enters the zone. But again, I think if the ball misses him, I think he just continues to swing and it's a strike. And Buck doesn't actually get tossed right after this. He gets tossed after Christian Yellis hit, hits a single to center, which kind of opens the game up. So let me know what you think. Do you think it's a swing? Do you think it's a hit by pitch? Again, tough call. I'm going to say I'm right there with Buck, and I'm going to get pissed if this happens to me. So let me know in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Give it a thumbs up, all that good stuff, and we'll talk to you later.